fun so far. I don't know about you, but I have really been missing UFC. It's been a long three weeks, but we made it. And of course, it's already weird. Our main event is not what the main event was supposed to be, and Dana White's in the news doing Dana White things, but I will get to that main event in just a second. First up, Jimmy Flick he's back? Yeah, he retired back in 21, but I guess he's not done. He pulled a Tom Brady and he is wanting back into the octagon. I don't really know how that's going to work for him because once you mentally just check out, I feel like you're checked out. So he's going up against Charles Johnson. Charles, as long as he keeps pressing him and doesn't lay back, get too lazy with it, I think he can beat him, especially with everything I just mentioned. So give me Johnson for the win. Next up, you're probably familiar with this one from a Holly Holm fight where Holly was robbed. It's Ketlin Vieira. She is taking on Raquel Pennington. Now, Pennington, she's just not very consistent. I can't trust that she can get this done. I feel like Vieira is really trying to prove herself, especially after that win against Holly Holm. So give me Vieira for the win with this one. And last but certainly not least, our main event that is our new main event. It's not Gastelum and Imavov anymore. It is now Sean Strickland. Sean Strickland is pulling through again. Except Strickland was not prepared for this only until a few days ago. He actually was riding his dirt bike and wrecked it. So that's where he's at mentally with this. He hasn't been training for a five round fight. I think this is going to hurt him when it comes to the win, but it's going to be fun. I think this is going to be a more fun fight than the original fight, honestly, but still give me Imavov. I think he's going to come out with the win. I don't know about you, but I am super excited to start off another year of MMA and I am keeping my fingers crossed for some amazing knockouts.